Back, part two. And I set the headers on here and messed up my paint in certain spots, like up here on the other side. But the coils will cover it up, so I'm not too worried about it. Uh, I need to get a, a, a heli coil kit, as you can see here. Uh, so this boat came right out, and the one on the back on the other side came right out. This one gave me big, big problems. I'm not too sure if I'm going to fix it or just go with it. I mean, every motor that I looked at when people pulled them, the back two boats broke for sure. So, I mean, it shouldn't be a big difference in the exhaust. Uh, I mean, I'm not too sure, but I don't really want to um, go too far into this. It's an OEM head, so it'll be somewhat faster to just replace it than to do all that so got the plates on I need to get sorry about that I need to get the other boat that's in the house and put that on and these are the one inch setbacks I need to get this other cover to cover the flywheel I got oh yeah so just so you all know the muscle car oil pan only one of the boats from the um, pin to the case the transmission case gonna line up so on the other side, it's just like free hanging, whatever. Um, what else? What else? What else? I got pictures of how all this stuff was, so it should be pretty simple. Um, the motor should be coming out this weekend. Should no guarantee, but I mean tomorrow should be coming out tomorrow. But started back on. I got the uh, cover on on there. All the screws on this side are in. And that's really it. I mean, haven't been able to do too much. Got school, got other projects and stuff going on too. So, just had to make sure I touched it this weekend and still try to get that motor out. But that's where we at right now.